interview the other day that um, that I watched with Anthony Joshua. He says that he's ready to take it to Usyk in his rematch to get his belts back. He's ready to take it to Usyk in an aggressive manner. And, you know, there's no more time for, you know, in, in, you know, loosely translated, he going there not to play no games and he going to get his bells back. Now, here's my thing. You know, Anthony Joshua, he fought Usyk in a non-aggressive manner, man. He wasn't aggressive enough. He didn't put the pressure on him enough. He was almost like passive in that fight. So that was one of the reasons he lost. And it can also be because Usyk is just a better boxer and more skilled. Right? So, you know, you take it back to Andy Ruiz, the first fight with Joshua. Andy Ruiz just mauled him. He was all over him and took advantage of him. He managed to knock Ruiz down, but he got back up. Anthony Joshua was uh, too massive, man, too much muscle. He went in there and out, got gassed out. Defeated himself, man. He mentally was he's mentally defeated, physically defeated. So him and his squad, they went back to the drum board for the rematch. Said, okay, this is what we're gonna do this time. And and then in the second fight with uh, Andy Ruiz, Joshua was more cautious, more calculated. Uh, he outboxed him. So what does that show us? It shows us that Anthony Joshua. He can box. He can outbox. But Andrew Ruiz is just a different. He's on a lower level than Joshua, man. He's a, he's not he's not on a. Uh, Andy Ruiz is not on the level of an Alexander Usyk, though. You see what I mean? Styles do make fights, and the way you fight fighters will judge the outcome of it, man. You got to be certain ways with certain fighters for you to even get close to winning, to a, a winning result, in my opinion. You know, for example, Andy Ruiz is not a boxer. I mean, he's more of a, like a brawler, a sloppy type fighter almost. He's a brawler. Um, he's like, he has a mixture of different styles in him, man, but he's not an outside boxer. He just, a, to me, I think Andy Ruiz is like a brawler. Almost like an Adam Kownatsky, almost something like that, but with with, with better head movement, you know, but um, Anthony Joshua realized you can't, you gotta, uh, with that kind of dude, I guess you gotta be on your feet, and you gotta be on your feet a little more, and you know, I think Floyd said it, it's, it's true when you think about it, sometimes it's not, but a lot of times it is, you gotta outbox the puncher and punch the boxer, it, it, you can apply that and it might be successful. Sometimes it's not, though. And he went in there and outboxed a brawler slash puncher or whatever you want to call Andrew Ruiz, and he won. Moved around much better than he did in the first fight. And then you got Alexander Usyk. And, you know, my prediction for that fight, I had Usyk losing. I said, Usyk doesn't have the power to really stop Joshua. I may have been wrong. It looked like he was about to stop him. It looked like he was about to. But he went in there and was too too passive against Alexander Usyk. He was trying to do what Usyk was doing. He was in there trying to box. He was doing he was doing in the fight with Usyk. Anthony Joshua was boxing the same way he was boxing Andrew Ruiz in their rematch. Can't do that. Not with not with somebody like uh, Alexander Usyk. It, it worked with Andy Ruiz. It's not gonna work with an Alexander Usyk. So Anthony Joshua, I guess he's like, okay, in the rematch, I'm gonna go in there and I'm gonna take my belt back this way. I'm going to be more aggressive. None of us know if that's gonna really be effective. It might. But the one thing I will say about Joshua, man, it looks like he has to lose to fighters to adjust to them next time he fights them. So he might go in there more aggressive. It might work for him, might not. But if he goes in there aggressive recklessly, 
It might in bad form again. If he goes in there with controlled aggression and he blends it a little bit, he's got a way better chance of being Usyk. Just my take. What y'all think about Anthony Joshua deciding to go the aggressive route in the Alexander Usyk rematch? Drop a comment, support the channel. I love y'all. Catch y'all later. Peace.